I'm gonna grab one of these catfish and they're pretty small and just completely deep fried to like an entire fish chip. That is completely crispy catfish all the way through. Hey everyone, it's Mark Weens with Migrationology.com in Jakarta, Indonesia. We're in a taxi on our way to an area of town called Permata Buana. And we are on our way to meet our friend Tarisha, who is taking us this evening to a restaurant that is well known for serving catfish and sambal chili sauce, which sounds delicious. We made it to the restaurant. It's called Permata Mubarok Number no. 1. And it's actually in a really busy area of West Jakarta. But then it's all of a sudden you get into this kind of very upscale neighborhood and it's really quiet and peaceful right here. And then there's a food stall right at the entrance of this kind of community, right inside the gate. Whatever things you want and then they deep fry everything. And then, okay. And then uh, chicken, tempeh tofu and then cabbage yep. um, this one is um, chicken skins liver yeah and then... this restaurant is famous for serving catfish but they also have a bunch of other things all deep fried that you can pick and choose whatever you want. And actually they just turned off the stove because they finished deep frying some batches of food. But when they have the stove on, it actually sounds like a jet engine because their stoves are so high pressure, high, high gas. And they have some giant woks filled with oil. They just deep fry everything until crispy perfection. There are four of us eating and we got a bunch, uh, an assortment of different deep fried products. Two catfish here, catfish are right in the middle. There's some soybean cakes, there's some chicken under here, there's some tofu, and then over here is some deep fried cabbage. I don't know if I've ever had deep fried cabbage in my life. Tarusha highly recommends it and it smells really, really good. And then finally to eat along with all of these deep fried crispy items, you've gotta have some sambal. So they had two different um, stone mortars full of freshly pounded or grinded sambal, which is chili sauce. This one is more of the spicy one they said and then this one is a more mild sauce, but it is gonna taste great along with rice and the crispy ingredients. I'm gonna quickly rinse off my fingers and set this washing bowl aside. And they also have two different types of rice here. You can get the just plain rice, but I got nasi uduk, which is coconut rice. And then they sprinkled on some crispy shallots on it as well. I gotta start with that cabbage because it's just too tempting and it's really, really fragrant. You can really smell that, that aroma of the cabbage. I'm gonna mix in some of that sambal onto the rice. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's really good. The cabbage, when it's deep fried, it's kind of chewy, but in a really good way. And it tastes like caramelized cabbage is what it tastes like. I'm gonna grab one of these catfish and they're pretty small and just completely deep fried to like an entire fish chip. Let me break him, break off some of that. Oh yeah, it definitely feels pretty oily. I take some of this with the sambal and transfer that over to my, my rice. Yes, that is completely crispy catfish all the way through. And then that one sambal that I had, it's kind of a tomato-y garlic sambal. It's not spicy, but really fragrant and you can really taste that like roasted garlic in it. That rice is a little bit rich from the coconut milk and then it has a salty taste to it as well. I'm gonna grab one of those skewers of chicken skin and I'm gonna use this skewer of chicken skin to wipe up that sambal. That again is just completely crispy all the way through. Sometimes I don't like chicken skin when it's only half deep fried and then it's um, it's just soft the other part. But this one is really good. It's just completely crispy, like like chicharrones. 
like deep fried skin. Yeah, that's actually extremely tasty. And then with, with the addition of that spicy sambal, oh man, that can make everything enhanced. To wash down that crispy, oily catfish, I have esjeruk, which is like a, an orange juice with ice cubes in it. Oh yeah, that's quite sweet and it tastes kind of like, yeah, orange, but it has kind of a tangerine taste to it as well. <laughs> Ying and I just made it back to our hotel after an excellent dinner. I loved that combination of the crispy fried catfish with the sambal chili sauce and then eating it all together with the nasi uduk, which is coconut rice. I want to say a big thank you to Tarisha. Tarisha also makes YouTube videos. She has a blog, an awesome blog, and she also has a great Instagram. I'll leave all of her links in the description box below. Be sure to check her out. Thank you all very much for watching this video. Please remember to give it a thumbs up and also make sure you subscribe for more food videos and I'll see you on the next food video.